Hey what's going on people, it is OG Tech here. And in today's video, I'm going to be showing you how to remove black bars in any game forever. We are going to fix this through the registry editor. So this can be done on any PC, whether it is an Intel, Nvidia, or AMD. So let's get into the video. First we will talk about why you are getting black bars. The most typical reason for this, that your game and display don't have the same aspect ratio. And if you're wondering what an aspect ratio is, this is the ratio of a screen's width to its height. Also, if your game and display resolution aren't the same, sometimes you will get black bars in some games. Another thing that can have an impact is outdated display drivers. Outdated drivers don't only cause black bars. This can impact overall PC performance. Also, some old games don't have a properly updated aspect ratio compared to modern games. So, because of these problems, you will most likely experience black bars in games, even though there are so many solutions on the internet. So many of them won't work anymore, and some of them have to do every time you open the game. So let's get into the process. So go to the Windows search bar, and type regedit, and open it. Now you need to navigate over to this location with me. So in H key local machine, expand system, and expand control set 001, and double click on control. And then you need to find graphic drivers. Simply click on one of these folders, and press G on your keyboard. Now expand it as well. After that, double click on configuration. Once you expand the configuration, you will see a bunch of files with different letters and numbers. Inside of these folders there is a 32-bit value called scaling. You need to change all the scaling values to the number 3 hexadecimal. So simply double click on a folder and expand this double zero folder. Again click on this double zero folder and you'll see scaling in here. So simply double click on it. Change its value to 3 and click OK. Now repeat the same thing for all the other folders. Once you've changed all the scaling values, make sure to restart your PC and you're good to go. 